family members of Menendez brothers unite to call for their release. Relatives of Lyle and Eric Menendez have come together to call for the pair's release from prison. Up to two dozen extended family members gathered for a news conference in Los Angeles, which was organized after prosecutors announced they were reviewing new evidence in their case. Eric Menendez, now 53 years old, and Lyle Menendez, 56 years old, are currently serving life sentences without the possibility of parole after being convicted of murdering their parents at their mansion in Beverly Hills more than 35 years ago. The killings have been in the spotlight in recent weeks following the release of Monsters, a Netflix dramatization of their story, as well as a documentary. In August 1989, the brothers shot their parents, Jose and Kitty Menendez, multiple times at close range. They were aged 18 years old and 21 years old at the time. They admitted the shootings, but maintained they killed their mother and father in self-defense after enduring physical, emotional, and sexual abuse over many years. Speaking at the news conference, Jose Menendez's niece Ana Maria Baralt announced that relatives had formed a new coalition called Justice for Eric and Lyle. She told reporters, both sides of the family are united, sharing a new bond of hope. This is about truth, justice, and healing. Their continued incarceration serves no rehabilitative purpose. Ms. Baralt said the brothers were victims of a culture that was not ready to listen, as she called on the district attorney's office to take into account the full picture. The news conference was the largest gathering of the extended family since the brothers were found guilty of first-degree murder and conspiracy to murder in 1996, seven years after the killings and following a second trial. However, their lawyers argued that because of society's changing views on sexual abuse, the outcome of a trial today might be different. Prosecutors had argued there was no evidence of any molestation and said the murders were committed so the brothers could inherit their parents' multi-million dollar estate. New evidence includes a letter written by Eric Menendez that his lawyers say corroborates allegations he was sexually abused by his father. A hearing is scheduled for November 29th.